There's something fascinating about hairy little spider feet. They look like they belong to dogs, or maybe even cats, or some curious creature that sprang from the brain of Dr. Seuss. From time to time, images of hairy spider paws make the rounds on social media, with people ooing and aahing about how cute they are and how much they resemble furry pet appendages. But those fuzzy feet, technically spider claw tufts, have all sorts of interesting purposes. Let's explore the mysterious phenomenon of hairy spider feet and why these unusual appendages are so important to our eight-legged friends. Firstly, let's take a closer look at what we mean by hairy spider feet. If you've ever seen a spider up close, you may have noticed the tiny hairs that cover their legs and feet. These hairs are actually called setae, and they serve a variety of important functions. For one thing, they help spiders grip onto surfaces and climb up walls and ceilings with ease. But that's not all. Setae also play a crucial role in a spider's sensory system, allowing them to detect vibrations and even smells in their environment. It's like ringing a dinner bell. The Goliath's venom. So why are spider feet hairy in the first place? Well, it turns out that this is a bit of a mystery. Some scientists believe that the hairiness of spider feet is simply an adaptation to help them move around more easily, while others think that it may be a way to help them detect prey or avoid predators. Whatever the reason, one thing is clear. These little hairy feet are key to a spider's survival in the wild. 